In this tutorial, I will show you how to make glow effect in Photoshop. You can download the image from the link in the description below. To make this image wider, go to the crop tool and expand the crop. Then tick the content overfill and hit OK. So now, select any of your favorite selection tools and select this branch precisely. I have already made a selection and saved and now I am going to load the selection. After selecting the object, now make a duplicate of the selection using shortcut key Ctrl plus J. Now use any of the various tools to select the goal. I am using this select subject tool to make a quick selection of the subject. You can deselect the branch using quick selection tool because we don't need it. Now go to select and mask and refine the selection using different tool. After refining the selection, hit OK. Now go to adjustments and create a exposure adjustment layer in the top of background layer. Now go to the branch layer. I'm gonna change the name first, then right click and convert it into a smart object. Now duplicate the layer. Select both layer and make it grow. Now select the top layer of the group and change its blending mode from normal to screen. Now go to filter menu, blur and gaussian blur. Make radius 5 pixels. Now duplicate the layer. Click to the Gaussian blur in the smart filter and make it 15 pixels. Again duplicate the layer. Click to the Gaussian blur and make it 115 pixels. And again duplicate the layer and now make it 300 pixels. After creating a glow effect, now go to adjustments and create a brightness and contrast adjustment layer. Decrease the brightness and increase the contrast accordingly. Now create a hue saturation layer on top of the group. Tick the colorize and create clipping mask. Make saturation on red and choose any color you want. Now create another hue saturation adjustment layer below the glow effect group. Again click the colorize and make saturation on red. 
After that, make hue value same as previous hue value. Now go to layer style and blending options. Break the slider using shortcut key Alt. Drag the slider all the way to right. Now create an exposure adjustment layer. Decrease the exposure value and close it. Invert the max using shortcut key Ctrl plus I. Now select the brush tool, make sure the foreground color is white and make the flow 15%. Now start painting to the area you don't want lighting. Now duplicate the hue saturation adjustment layer, increase the lightness, close it and invert the max. Now select the brush tool, again make sure foreground color is white. Now start painting to the area you want it to be little shiny. Now the effect is pretty much done. To make it more live and beautiful, we have to add glowing shiny particles. To make that, first create a new layer on the top of all layer. Select the brush, right click and choose special effects brushes. Now go to brush setting panel, adjust the spacing and close it. Now just paint around the branch. To make it glowing, do the same process we did to make brands glow. Now select all three layers and make it group. After that, create a hue saturation adjustment layer. Tick the colorize, create clipping mask. Make the same hue saturation value like others. You can also change the color of all these light just by changing hue of every hue saturation adjustment layer. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to this channel for more amazing tutorial. Thanks for watching.